Hi everybody, Millie here. I woke up this morning and YouTube told me that I had 100 subscribers. So I said to myself, I should show everybody how I make my videos. So I'm going to do that right now. So we're on the iPhone right now, so it's going to be a little shaky. But I want to show you how I make the videos. Because I know when I first started my YouTube channel, I did a lot of searching and stuff to actually find out how to do this. So maybe I can save somebody some effort. Obviously, you all know about the Clico Atom. That right there. So let's just give you a little brief tour. That's a BMC monitor. That's the Clico Atom itself. That's a serial adapter. The disk drive. The ADE controller right there, which is the SD card. Printer. Some diskettes. In the background right there, you may see this and wonder what it is. That's a television, obviously. But what that television is doing is, it is connected to, back there behind the set, down in that black box, a Sony 3D DVD player, which actually has a USB input. So what I've got is I've got one hour of MTV bumpers, which is their commercials, on loop. So, I get MTV in the background. Over here, this is my bench, where I do my work. The Texas Instruments I'm going to be working on soon, it's got bad keyboards. This camera right here is my bench camera. It is permanently attached there. Well, the tripod is permanently attached. And I can remove this and put it back on. When I go and work, I would stand next to the camera and I can reach around, get a nice steady image, and it doesn't change from shot to shot. That right there is a soft light that I made. And I have, a cop I have another one over here. I'm going to put a link down in the description on how to make them. Each one cost me 10 bucks. They work very well. Over here, we have our main camera setup. That's a Windows 10 system. It's not an expensive system. It's actually, I think it's about five or six years old. It's running Microsoft Camera, or Windows Camera, and Audacity. Plugged into the system is this Logitech HD webcam on a tripod and then I have my microphone that clips on there. On the floor you'll notice these little white dots here and there. That's where I, when I finally got the camera placement I wanted, I put, dot, I put stickers on the floor so I know where to put the tripod so the shots are always the same. All my control, all the adjustments are locked so nothing changes. So when I go to film a video, I'll hit start on that, start on that, go over to there and film the video. And then afterwards, I take the video and the audio up there to my other system for editing. If I did any work on the bench, I take the memory card out of that and take it to my other system for editing. Now, if I'm going to actually work on the computer here and I want to capture the content that's coming off of it, I have the composite video that comes out right there, split, and I run it over to this $10 Easy Capture USB device hooked up to a Windows 10 laptop. This is running OBS, which is an open source software. Let's me capture and save things to disk, which I then copy to a USB, take to my video system, or to my main computer for editing. And over here, just so you know the video, the software, Audacity and camera. I just want to make sure you know those because I searched and searched. And if you're wondering what that is, it just went to sleep, interestingly enough. That's a Raspberry Pi system that I mounted on the back of a TV, an LCD TV, an HDMI TV. And that system basically is just a serial modem for my Atom. Now we're going to walk through, and I have a backlight here pointing up into the air to cut shadows. We'll walk through the connecting hallway here. This is my main office. That's my 286 system that I do 5 and 4 inch discs on, the laptop I'm going to work on, a Windows XP system which runs an actual runs a bulletin board that I'm going to be using in upcoming videos and putting on a line eventually. And then right here is my editing system. Again, it's the computers I use. I'm not using all six of them. The one on the bottom there, the silver Dell, it's the same as the one in the other office, with more RAM and a bigger hard drive, two hard drives actually. 
That's a Windows 10 system. And above it is a Windows 7 system. And those are old XP computers, which are right now just stands. But eventually they're going to become Linux or DOS systems. So the Windows 7 system was an older system I used. It still has my email. And then over here I use OpenShot Video Editor for editing my videos. And then obviously you upload things to YouTube. And I have the systems connected, so it's all one mouse, one keyboard. And that right there is when I need to exercise, I jump on my bike. So I thought I'd give everybody a nice little preview of what the, or look at what the office is and how things are made. Again, I'll walk back through here. Little dot matrix printer, which is plugged into the Atom. And then back here, if you're just curious, that right there, that's my beautiful wife Heather and my beautiful daughter Autumn Rain. I got ET, I got Elephant, Sewer Sam. That's an early 80s stereo system and that, do that double tape deck on there, I used to use that to copy data packs when I was making data packs before it actually started to go bad and was copying slower. And it's uh, it started to go bad when the gear started to wear out, so it's copying slow, copying fast, so I had to get the other system I have now, the, the copy yet system. And some 80s albums, ColecoVision, ALF, and the like. And down here, some more tchotchkes. So there you go. Give me a quick tour, like I said, show you how everything works. And thank you everybody for subscribing to my channel. We made it to 100. Now we need to make it to 1,000. If you know anybody who wants to help support the channel, please have them subscribe. Thank you.